Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to make these coasters. I think they make a great gift for Father's Day. I chose comics because my husband likes them, but obviously you can use whatever you want, maybe beer cardboards or magazines or anything you want. So I'm going to show you how to make it. But first, if you're new to my channel, please subscribe if you want to watch more videos related to motherhood and lifestyle. I upload a new video every week. Okay, so let's get started. Okay, so this is what we're going to use. These ceramic tiles. Here I got them at Lowe's. They were like 88 cents each. So yeah, they're cheap. You can choose any size you want. Then here I have some comics that my husband likes. Then felt. This is the darkest color I found. You can use like gray or a darker color if you if you can find. Then uh, matte podge. And this um, high gloss coating, this is a lacquer. You can use um, any type you want. I got this at Hobby Lobby, but you can find it at any craft supply store. This is for uh, give give it um, a gloss finish so it can be water resistant. Okay, so let's get started. Okay, first cut your piece of paper or cardboard into square shapes. You can trace them with a pen first if you want. It's always better to cut them a little bigger and then you trim them to get the perfect fit and then you do the same with the felt. Okay, next apply a layer of matte patch to the back of the square using a small brush and attach to the front of the tile and allow to dry it for at least 15 minutes. Okay, so we stick the piece of felt to the tile. We apply a layer of matte patch to the tile, not the felt, this is very important. And we spread it with the brush and we stick the felt on it. After that, we apply two to four layers of matte podge over the top of the squares, allowing each layer to dry for about 10 minutes before applying the next one. Just a thin layer, not that much as I did here. And then we let it dry 10 minutes before we apply the next layer. And when it's dry, we spray two coats of the high gloss lacquer for added protection. And we allow to dry for 24 hours. And it's better if it's outside because the smell is really strong. It's overnight and seems okay. Maybe I'll put a little, one more coat of the lacquer. But overall, I think it's fine. Okay, so they are ready. I finished the other three. So they are done. They have the gloss lacquer, so they are protected now. They are waterproof now. They have the felt on the back. And yeah, I think they are good. They are ready to use. <laughs> okay, so I hope you like this video. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up if you like it. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.